A local religious leader from Mobile is suing the Alabama Department of Corrections, claiming the DOC discriminates against non-Christians ministering to death row inmates. As Chad Petrie reports, the plaintiffs say the current policy hurts people of all faiths. Is this an issue of religious freedom or has the Alabama Department of Corrections pretty much sidestepped the issue by not allowing any clergy in the execution chamber at all? Mobile Imam Yusuf Mazanet has been ministering to Muslims at home in prison for more than six years. A new complaint filed on his behalf by the Council on American Islamic Relations, or CARE, says before convicted murderer Dominic Ray was executed in 2019, Mazanet was not allowed to administer last rites or be with Ray in the execution chamber, even though Ray was Muslim, and requested the imam. But the DOC allegedly allowed the prison's Christian chaplain there instead. The complaint also says shortly before the execution of convicted cop killer Nathaniel Woods, the Department of Corrections changed its policy and now no longer permits any clergy in the execution chamber before an inmate is put to death. The complaint says that was done explicitly to keep non-Christians out of the execution chamber. The complaint goes on to say the policy restricts the religious freedom for all inmates on death row with no spiritual advisor present to offer prayers or last rites. In Mobile, Chad Petrie, WKRG News 5. The federal civil complaint was filed last Thursday. We have reached out to the Alabama Department of Corrections. A spokesperson says they cannot comment at this time.